This is Kelsey speaking on behalf of Group 16, and I want to talk to you a little bit about bounce houses. These toys are undoubtedly very fun for children, and sometimes even adults. However, they are very dangerous when misused. Children have a tendency to become overzealous in high action situations, such as playing in a bounce house, and can easily injure one another if the rules are not followed closely. The rules are commonly just used as a guide and often ignored. Some problems we'd like to point out is the flawed rule of age limits, anchoring the device in wind control, and unsupervised children. It is also important to be wearing proper attire while enjoying the bounce house. No shoes, exposed zippers, eyeglasses, or anything sharp should be worn in the bounce house. Under the bounce house rules, it states specifically no children over the age of 12. Bounce houses should be limited by a weight limit, similar to how trampolines are limited. However, adults should still not be allowed in the bounce houses, no matter how close to the weight limit you are. Also, remember to sandbag your bounce house. Stakes are not enough. Not only are winds a problem, but children who run rampant can be a huge issue. Watch this clip of the bounce house collapsing. It takes all of two seconds. If a child should get behind the device and cut off the airflow, children inside of the house can become trapped and easily panic. If your child is under the age of five, the collapse of a bounce house can easily cause injuries or potential death if your child should become trapped under the heavy plastic. It's important that your child be supervised to prevent incidents like this. As always, please have fun and remember to be safe in your bounce house.